<laughs> you staring at yourself, Lucky Bear? It's a good boy. I'm the gift for you, Lucky Bear. Look how handsome he looks. Lucky Bear, you're just so handsome. You're the most handsome boy ever. Okay. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Sunday. I am off, thankfully. Thank God, because it's been a long, rough week at work. Very busy. If you guys are new here, my name is Ashley. I am a licensed hairstylist. I work at a salon here in Orlando, Florida, and I do content creation on the side. So if you like lifestyle, beauty, hair-related content, don't forget to follow me or subscribe, and don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Ashley, and to see a little bit more behind the scenes. We have Lukey Bear here making his little appearance. Okay, okay, Lukey Bear, what, what, what? <laughs> I think he's over it. He doesn't want to sit here anymore. Right, Lukey Bear, you want to go on the floor? So like I said, today is Sunday and it's gonna be a very productive Sunday, even though I'm extremely tired. Um, usually our productive Sundays start with going to the gym. I actually skipped the gym this morning and Ryan did too because I'm just so tired from the work week. I really need a rest day and just like relax my body, especially now that I am 31 weeks pregnant. I need to start chilling out and not going so intense all the time. So yeah, we had a very slow morning, woke up at like eight. Well, I woke up at 7.30, got out of bed at 8, and had breakfast, I ordered some clothes on ASOS because I'm going to a wedding next week, and I'm also going to have my brunch baby shower salon, salon brunch baby shower, so I need an outfit for that. He's falling asleep. He's so handsome. This is my little looky bear, if you guys didn't know. He's my little whole world. He's my little baby boy. So anyways, um, yeah, so I skipped the gym this morning, chilled for a bit, had a slow morning, and then now I just got ready. It's 10 a.m., 10.14. We're about to go and start this productive day. So the first thing we're gonna do is go to Home Depot. Ryan is going to give my locker a makeover at work. So we're gonna go to the salon. Uh, well, we have to go to Home Depot first to get paint and a couple things that I need. And we're gonna redo my locker. I'm so excited. And then after, I'll probably just head back home. Ryan has a couple things to do at home, projects to do, and I'm gonna start nesting. So we're gonna start organizing baby girl's room, get it all together. So I'm super excited. And I might do a couple other things, like step out, go to TJ Maxx or Marshalls to get a lamp for her room. And just like a couple other things, maybe go to Target. So we'll see where the day takes us. Usually I will write a whole list of things to do, but I have really bad carpal tunnel and my hands just won't allow me to do anything these days. So that is the plan for today and I'm super excited. So I'm gonna bring you guys along with. Um, let's just start the Sunday. Oh, I wanna show you guys my outfit real quick cause it's super cute. Luke's hair literally just got all over me, but this is where my purse. My Louis, love her so much. So I'm wearing this like um, romper jumpsuit that I got from Sheen. This is from the brand Glow Mode. This brand is literally the same as Lululemon. Crazy, it's so comfy. It is a bit tight on me. Like this seam area here is kind of like bothering my stomach. It's making it like a little itchy, but it will do. And then this little button up is actually from a thrift store. I watched this YouTuber and she does like thrifting videos and I got really inspired by her. And so I went to the thrift store and got this for like, how much was it? Like $5 It's a Sean John. I probably got it for $4. Just like a nice little button up, um, beige. I feel like it goes with a lot of things. It's a men's extra large. So I thought it'd be perfect for like pregnancy. So yeah, I love this like little outfit. And then I have my nude balances with my compression socks because we're gonna be moving around today. And then this is the stuff I'm gonna put in my locker. Well, Ryan's gonna put it for me. Hopefully he can put this disco ball in my locker, this mirror. And I have this cute little light that I found cleaning out my closet. Maybe I can put it somewhere in my locker, but I'm so excited. So we're gonna head out and start this practice Sunday.
hello it is now several several hours later as you guys saw in the video ryan did such an amazing job giving my locker a makeover i'm just gonna quickly put some lip color on because i'm looking rough right now we did have a couple rough bumps on the way he kind of got the measurements of the wood um messed up so he had to like re like cut it also when we got to home depot they didn't have the actual wood cutters so we had to go to lowe's and it was like 15 minutes away and then we got to work i realized that i have my keys but luckily somebody was in the salon and the roller for the drawer wasn't really like working but he managed to put it together and make it look pretty i have like paint all over me but yeah shout out to ryan you are literally the best i love you so much best hubby ever because there's no way i could have done that myself or anyone honestly <laughs> We were there pretty late. We got there at, I honestly don't even remember what time we got there, like uh, 11.30 to the salon. Probably got there at 11.30, 12. And we didn't leave till 3.30, so we were there for a hot minute. So anyways, we got back home. I kind of rested for a little bit. Now I am at Marshall's. I'm gonna buy a lamp for Riley's room so that way it can start nesting a little bit tonight. I'm not gonna do a whole lot because I am extremely tired. There's people walking by. I'm not gonna do a whole lot today because I am extremely, extremely tired. I mean, I'm tired all the time, but <laughs> I am really tired today. So, so I'm just gonna go in, get the lamp, and leave. And then I'm gonna go to Five and Below and return something and head home. So let's do that. We are in baby girl's room right now, and I'll show you guys the lamp that I got from Marshall's and I did really good. I went to Marshall's got the lamp got a mirror for her For above the dresser and I just got like a couple like small like things Nothing crazy. So I did pretty good at Marshall's. So this is the lamp. I ended up getting now that I'm looking at it It's a little like crooked. I'm sure Ryan can probably fix it. I don't know if it has to do with this up here Because the top was missing and the lady at the cashier had an extra one. I honestly am not sure about this, but I know Ryan can fix it. Ryan can fix anything. I, he's gonna have to like mess with this or something. Ooh. Oh, did I jam it in there? Oh, I don't even know, guys. Okay, whatever. He can fix this. And this lamp was $39.99. They didn't have a lot of options, surprisingly, with the lamps. I wanted more like a boho, but I didn't want to wait any longer. I wanted her room to be more of a lampy feel and not with that ceiling light, if you know what I mean. I did get the same chan I did get the same chandelier that's in my glam room. We're gonna put it in here too. I'll show you guys if you don't know. So the chandelier pair, I bought the same exact one on Amazon to put in her room. Look at storm storm. We're gonna replace that with that so but in the meantime i just i hate that light so much so i have this love it and then also my mom had an extra echo that she doesn't use shout out to my mom so i love these have them all over the house I have them in my glam room downstairs in our bedroom and i think that's it now in now in her room so that way i can tell Alexa to turn on and off the lights. It's just very convenient. I can play music. It's really nice. Um, so I'll show you guys like a little sneak peek of her room. It's a mess, but this is the start of the nesting. Shout out to Ryan. He ended up picking up this dresser from... It's an Ikea dresser. It's the same exact dresser that I wanted. This he got from actually Facebook Market. Um, he just replaced the knobs. I got these knobs from Amazon. So it's more like boho neutral feel um and then that rocker i got from amazon i'm not gonna lie i wish i should have got the white color i thought this was gonna be more of a light beige it looks brown <laughs> so it's gonna be really hard to find an ottoman that matches that so we'll see how that goes and then a bunch of gifts books and stuff from the shower that i still need to organize we have a lot of organizing to do by the way in this room <laughs> this is like not even the beginning that little basket there is full of toys that we received from the baby shower and, and from some of my clients as well um this tree here i got a small little olive tree not sure how i'm feeling about this i have a stand for it so that way it looks a little bit more better um this is a gift from one of ryan's co-workers and this is a crib this is the delta 
the Delta Children crib or, or the Delta four in one crib. I got it from Amazon, pretty affordable, it was 200 bucks. And I like how it has the wooden legs. And I'm gonna end up putting a half sun up here from um, Etsy, it's like a wall decor or a sticker. And also currently there's a hailstorm right now here in Florida. I don't know if you can hear it, a little ASMR. If you can hear that, that is hail. <laughs> it's pretty bad. Um, then this is her closet. So Ryan's had put together the crib. He surprised me and we got rid of his desk. It's in our bedroom right now, which I'll show you guys in a bit. So yeah, he surprised me after work this week and put all this together. I was like so happy. He even put the little diaper trash can together. And then this is her closet. We have all of the papers that we got from the baby shower and gender reveals. So we're just super blessed. Honestly, this hailstorm is kind of like distracting me right now. <laughs> These hangers I actually got from my coworker. She didn't need them from her little girls anymore, so thank you to her. Um, I honestly prefer these hangers more, but I'll take anything. I'm gonna end up putting all these hangers in the back so that we can kind of hide, and then just keep these hangers in the front. A little sneak peek of some of her clothes. This girl is so freaking spoiled. Y'all don't even know. Look what my mother-in-law got me. She is the best. Look at these little cute shorts. So freaking cute. Look at this little denim jacket. Oh my god, I can't even. And lots of baby stuff. I do have my empties down there, which I've accumulated for the last months. For the last six months. And I need to do something with it because it needs to go in the trash. And more gift bags and all that. So that is like a little gist of everything. Blankets, boppies, stuffed animals. And as you can see, there's a little sneak peek of her name. <laughs> I There you go. That's her name right there. Um, and then we also have the Kinkaroo uh, changing table or changing mat. I'm so happy I got this. I put this on my registry last minute because it is expensive and I'm just so happy I received it. Shout out to my friend Brianna for gifting it to us. I'm so out of breath. <laughs> So yeah, just like a little bit of everything. This is all the cards I got from Baby Shower um, right here. I already started on the diapers and more stuff from her and then more hygiene stuff. So that is like a little sneak peek of what's going on in this room. I'm gonna do a full blown nesting video. Maybe, well next week is Super Bowl. I don't know about that, but mm, yeah, I don't know. Super Bowl, I, yeah, I don't know. But, I don't think I can film it next Sunday, but maybe like Monday or Tuesday I can like film a dedicated nesting vlog. Um, this is kind of honestly a little overwhelming for me. I don't even know where to begin. <laughs> I know I need to do the clothes maybe at the end of the month, um, like wash all the clothes and then put them away. So yeah, I'm so out of breath. We had five guys when I left um, Marshall's, I picked up so we can eat it here and it was so good literally hit the spot i also forgot to show you guys ryan did set up the bassinet as well I ended up changing the bassinet i originally had a like beige aesthetically pleasing bassinet that matched the aesthetics in the room and i ended up taking it out because it didn't have wheels on it and it didn't have like this bottom storage so i ended up getting this, this is from amazon it has really good reviews it has wheels on it so I can move it around. Um, I'm gonna put this next to the bed when she's born and it's just nice to like kind of keep her mobile. And then this is where Ryan's like new office area is. We're just gonna make it work um, for a while and see how that goes. So that is everything. Oh, out of breath. So that kind of wraps up my productive Sunday. I feel like I didn't get enough content today but I was very busy. We just had a little couple hiccups at the salon because of the measurements and all that. I'm out of breath. Sorry guys. Whew. But I'm so grateful and glad that Ryan ended up giving my locker makeover. It really needed it. I've been feeling kind of stressed at work with my carpal tunnel and just not, you know, feeling the same, being very tired. So it just feels so nice to have like a little refresh of my locker that I can get kind of like re-motivated and a little bit more excited to work. <laughs> and then also Riley's room is coming together slowly. Um, but I'm gonna do a full nesting video just for that. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Also don't forget to subscribe down below to help your girl out. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.